Katie Woodham was a healthy wife and mom of three when she was diagnosed with COVID-19 and the flu early this summer. Um, I really just thought I had a cold to begin with. You know, I knew I had a weird headache. I never lost my sense of taste or smell. Katie describes her headaches as an ice pick gauging behind her eyes and temples. And just as soon as the headaches would start, they'd be gone. Aside from the headaches, Woodham felt severe stomach cramping and said she had a dry mouth and dry eyes. Once the symptoms intensified, she finally went to the doctors. They did my test and they said, oh, we'll just call you with the results and then we'll call you in medicine to go with it. And then about 45 minutes later, they called me and told me I had flu and flu flu B and then COVID. Woodham says she doesn't know anyone she could have gotten sick from, but attributes contracting the virus to a family trip to Florida. You know, in Florida, they didn't have the mass laws like we had, and it was kind of before COVID got, you know, everybody, everybody was getting COVID in other places, but it was before it was prevalent here. When Katie found out she had COVID and the flu, she decided to share her journey on Facebook to spread awareness. She informed her friends of every new symptom, including difficulty breathing, fatigue, and fevers. Since Katie was dealing with the twin demic, her doctors treated each illness separately with antibiotics, inhalers, and steroids for three and a half weeks. I feel like people don't understand it until they have a loved one or a family member that has experienced it. It's kind of like it's never going to happen to me. And then when it finally does, you understand it. Katie urges the community to continue wearing face masks and taking precautions to be able to protect one another. Covering local news first, in Dothan, Ileana Capellan, WDHN News.